Hello, this is David Erickson with the eStrategy Internet Marketing Blog at e-strategyblog.com. And for today's uh, marketing screencast, I want to take a look at YouTube's new feature. Um, they've introduced an online editing tool. So you can do basic um, splices and uh, edits of your online videos after you've uploaded them to YouTube. You get to the tool by uh, going to youtube.com slash editor and uh, when you're logged into your YouTube account then it will recognize the videos that you've already uploaded and uh, offer you uh, offer them to you uh, for editing and so this is the screen and you can see that I've got some clips here I'm going to take a uh, clip that I took um, Friday night of uh, my company's 20th anniversary uh, party and I want to splice off just the end part of it because uh, as you'll see it's a uh, it's um, not very uh, enjoyable viewing. <laughs> so there it is. And it's just a panoramic view of the party. I pan around the entire room. And when I get to the end, you'll see that. Now I'm taking this with my iPod. Uh, nano video recorder so it's not fantastic quality but at the end I have to figure out find the switch to turn it off and uh, that at that point the camera gets pointed down there we go and I want to edit this so I'm going to bring it to about the 38 second mark and drag this across nope that's from the beginning I want to drag this to that point in the video where there we go right there and that's where I want to edit so I just want to keep the beginning until the point where I start pointing the camera down I'm gonna save that okay and then you'll see that my uh, the timeline the uh, the number of uh, seconds for this video clip has been reduced from uh, 44 seconds to 39 seconds so you know that I've uh, edited it and then I am going to um, just type in the title here Toonheim Partners 20th Anniversary Party at Target Field and I'll publish that. Now you notice the, uh, and then it gives you the uh, the uh, traditional form that you have when you're uploading a video. And I'm just going to save that there. And uh, one last thing I want to show you, I'm going to go back to the editing mode, and then that'll process and it'll be available as the uh, edited clip editor. You'll also notice that there is an audio tab on the video editor, and here it's pre-populated with. Um, uh, soundtracks from audio from the audio swap library um, that you can use with your videos and they're um, copyright safe so um, uh, you can search for them or grab the tracks that are on there and add them to the uh, audio timeline there and uh, the caveat with this is if you use any of them advertisements may displayed on videos that contain soundtracks to the audio swap library so if you're going to use them expect to uh, possibly have some videos within or advertising within your videos as well as a result of that but that's it very easy uh, editor it's uh, it's welcomed because uh, now we can uh, cut our clips down to size and uh, make them more palatable for uh, our audiences uh, without having to go through the frustration of using some um, very sophisticated video editing tools that we may need a PhD to uh, understand. So that's it. Thank you for watching. This has been the uh, marketing podcast by me, David Erickson, of the eStrategy Internet Marketing Blog at e-strategyblog.com. Come and visit. Uh, subscribe to the RSS news feed if you want. Um, or follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash D Erickson. I hope you found the video uh, useful or enjoyable or entertaining or all of the above. Uh, if you did, subscribe. Subscribe. Click on the subscribe button. Subscribe to the eStrategy channel. Um, love your feedback. I would love to hear what you think about the video or if you have anything uh, 
uh, to add, uh, leave them leave them in the comments below. And uh, if you like this, if you found it useful, remember to uh, like the video, like the video, share it wherever you want, Twitter, Facebook, wherever else, uh, embed it if you've got a blog. And, uh, and also remember that the links to the content that we talked about are in the description. So uh, if you need, to, need those links, go uh, check out the description. And thanks again for watching.